Hello everyone, I'm Chaitanya Kancharla, Technical Expert for Simulation X at ESI. In this video, we are going to see how referencing can be used to greatly reduce the effort it takes to parameterize large models with many components, and also to see how it can reduce the mistakes that occur while parameterizing models with too many components. So in this model, we can see a powertrain, which is quite elastic. It has several inertias and several spring damper elements. Now, if I were to go and parameterize each of these things, then I'll have to click on each of them and then change the parameters accordingly. Now, as you can imagine, this is a long and tedious process, and it could happen that I might make a mistake somewhere, which will give me improper results. So to avoid this, what I can do is I can create a record over here. Input, name it input parameters. We can also see in give it a nice little icon and then start adding the parameters in the component uh, page and these parameters can later on be referenced into their respective elements so i'll start i'll give the first example let's say this is the inertia of shaft one Let's give it a unit. Let's give it a default value. Likewise, I can add all the other parameters that I would require. Side shafts, etc. And also for the stiffnesses and dampers, etc. So once that is done, the record is created in the types window. We can then drag and drop this record into the diagram view of the model. Then we can copy the ident of the parameter that we would want to reference and reference it appropriately in the respective component. So this model has been parameterized accordingly. So you can see all the references, all the relevant references are already where they should be. So in this way, we can now enter all the parameters at one place and ensure that we do not make mistakes while parameterizing these components. And additionally, if we want to export these parameters into an Excel file, that could also be done. And so any changes that care that is that is made to this Excel file can be imported into the model using the COM interface. So that, and as you can see, the inertia of the shaft two parameter has varied. So this is one way of using the referencing so that it eases the parameterization of a model with too many components.